There we go. I'm recording now. Okay. Hi. Good evening. Anybody here for the um, love fest today? Yep. Everybody, everybody's here. Cool. It was fun. Sandy did a great job. <laughs> well, most everybody knows what's going on. All kinds of stuff. This is obviously the second service for today. Uh, Holistic Chamber of Commerce meeting on Tuesday. Essential oils on Tuesday. House clearing class um, that Janice and Sandy are giving is free. Uh, they're doing that on Wednesday. So if that's of interest to you, um, talk to Jan. Yeah, this is not how to vacuum your house. This is how to clear it of negative energies. And yes, yes. And the only reason is someone had asked and actually thought that's what that was. So. Um, they were disappointed. I think they were disappointed, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Mind shifters on Wednesday. Lotus Group is not going to be doing it this month or next month or August. So they're coming back in September. They're taking the summer off. Things that make you go, hmm. Sports do not build career. Do, sports do not build character. They reveal it. An appraiser is one who feeds a crocodile. I did it. Boy. An appeaser is one who feeds a crocodile, hoping that it will eat him last. No man is rich enough to buy back his past. Or woman, for that matter. So, Robin Williams, Tom Cruise, Gene Hackman, and Dr. Seuss were all voted least likely to succeed by their classmates. <laughs> Shows you what they know. <clears throat> Anybody read the paper today? There was a great article in there about a uh, family in the parade section, actually that we're having a, um, well, they're having a few years of making some rather poor decisions. And um, it was just getting worse and worse, actually. Um, mom and dad got out of prison and, um, you know, trying to find jobs. I mean, in the family, it's just, it was, it was not a pretty story until uh, there was an accident, car accident. And this gentleman and the son, which also had gotten into some other trouble, and daughter, they went and saved this other guy's life. I mean, pulled him out of the car before it caught fire and you know, he would have perished. So the uh, town <clears throat> started treating them different and the uh, father actually said, you know, this might be a sign. This is an opportunity and they started to all of them turn their lives around. So they had made a conscious decision that boy, you know, Okay, I got to talk oh, about Oh, a little bit more so? Okay, right. okay. So here's the deal. The, the dad... I wasn't going to do this, but... The dad says, was praying, and he said, just give me a chance. Just give me a chance to prove that I'm a, I'm a good person. And right after that, they were, they were late. They were supposed to be somewhere. They had to go pick up the, the mother somewhere, and they were late, and ended up um, just hearing this loud bang, and it was this car accident. And the guy was a boxer, so he was, he was built up pretty good. And he was probably the only person that could have opened that car door. Because both car, the car had rolled, so both doors were, were wedged. wedged shut, jammed. And so he was probably the only one that could have been strong enough to muscle that open. And the two, as soon as he got it open, his two kids grabbed this guy by his clothes and dragged him out just as the car went boom. So since then, they've... It's just been a whole turnaround. But all that to say is prayer is powerful. Prayer is really powerful. Mm -hmm. You ask for it, you got it. If we had talked about this first, I'd have gotten the story straight. And... No, you're fine. <laughs> um, Maury, an 82-year-old man, went to the doctor to get a physical. A few days later, the doctor saw Maury walking down the street with a gorgeous young woman under his arm. A couple of days later, the doctor spoke to Maury and uh, said, You're really doing great, aren't you? Maury replied, just doing what you said, Doc. Get a hot mama and be cheerful. Doctor said, I didn't say that. I said, you've got a heart murmur. Be careful. <laughs> so. We hear what we want to hear. 
what we want to hear. Yes, we do hear what we want to hear. Yes. Let's sing a song. <laughs>